What's good you guys? So today I'm going to be showing you how to create a fake background for your YouTube videos. So first I'm going to be showing you how to do it on a laptop. What you want to do is go to canva.com and then you want to go into the search bar and you want to type in YouTube thumbnail. So once you get to this screen, you're going to go ahead and create a blank template. And your screen should look like this. Once you get here, you're going to go ahead and click out of any pop-ups on the screen. And then you're going to go ahead and head on to the left side of the panel and select elements. From there, you're going to go ahead and scroll all the way down to where it says create your own and this is just an AI image generator once you select that it gives you the option to go ahead and describe the image that you want for your background I'm just going to go ahead and add some random keywords as to what you know I desire my background to look like so you can enter things like a desk with a flat screen on it a table a plant if you want like a modern lamp an art piece on the wall and so forth once you have your description you're going to go ahead and scroll down and then select generate from here AI is going to go ahead and show you the images that they came up with um, you can go ahead and select the ones that you desire if you do not like the ones that um, pop up on the screen you can scroll back down and select generate again and it will give you some new images but for the purposes of this video i'm just going to go ahead and select one of these so you guys can see how it's done so once you select on the image it's going to appear on your template and you just want to go ahead and fill it in so that it fits the entire um sizing of the thumbnail Once you have the image how you like it, you can position it however you please. You're going to go ahead and scroll down and add a second image to the second page. And I'm just doing this just to have multiple um, options. You do not have to do this step. Once you have all of your backgrounds, you're going to go ahead and click at the right top corner where it says share and you're going to go ahead and download all of your images. When I'm editing my videos, I like to use CapCut, so that's what you see me doing here. Um, so I'm just going to head on over to CapCut and import those images that I just downloaded from Canva. And you just want to select on one of them. Once you have your background, now it's time to import your video that you want to upload for YouTube. Here I just have a random video. And you're going to go ahead and drag both of, both of those down at the bottom so that the links are matching up. Next, what we want to do is actually remove the background of the original video that we're using. So you're going to go on over to the right side of the screen and you'll see where it says remove background. So you just want to click on that. And then scroll down to the bottom where it says auto removal and check that box. It may take a while for your background to remove, but just be patient. So once your background is actually removed, you're going to go back over to the left side of the screen and you're going to select effects under video effects and you're going to select blur. Now what this is going to do is blur the background of the video so it's not as dominant and then you're going to position your video or your image wherever you like it and then export 
and that's it that's how you do it on the laptop now i'm going to move on over and show you guys how to do it on the mobile phone it's pretty much the same exact steps just a smaller version so you're going to go ahead and head on over to the canva app if you have it installed if you don't go ahead and install it and you're going to go ahead and type in the search bar the same exact thing youtube thumbnails select on create blank And then you're going to go ahead and select on elements down at the bottom or the side wherever it's located go down to generate your own type in the description of your backgrounds for the purposes of this video i'm going to be using the images that i already downloaded from the previous example so i'm kind of skipping a step here because at this point i'm already in my video editing software which is CapCut. so you're going to go ahead and take that image go back over over to um, whatever app you're using for me it's cap cut and then you're going to again drag both of the templates so that they're matching up at the same length and then you're going to go on over to remove background remove the background of your video once again position it to your liking And then if you want to, you can go ahead and again, blur that background so it's not as harsh. So you're going to go all the way back out and click on effects. And click on video effects. Scroll on over to lens and look for blur. Once you have that, you can go ahead and adjust it to your liking. And there you pretty much have it, you guys. It is taking a minute for my background to remove, but again, just be patient. And this is how your video should turn out. And also make sure you drag the blur so that it matches up with the full length of the video as well. And yeah, you guys, that's pretty much it. You can go ahead and export your video from here and upload it straight to YouTube. I really hope that I helped you guys. Um, I want to thank you all so much for clicking to watch this video. If you have not already, hit that subscribe button. Go subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.